Uh, John Simpson, what a day for Middlesex today, bat and ball. Um, it was just about in the balance last night, but Middlesex all three sessions today. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, if you just said uh, we were a 300 lead at the end of the day, I think we'd have bitten your hand off for that. Uh, you know, the boys obviously up front this morning did a great job with the ball, and then obviously uh, Mark Stoneman played an outstanding innings, and obviously, uh, you know, the contributions towards the you know the start and, and through the middle um, really set the game up for us. So, you know, as I said, to, to be 300. Um, Ahead at the uh, you know, end of the day is uh, such a fantastic position to be in. What was the pitch like today? I mean, often day two can be the best day to bat, but obviously you've had the gloves on um, throughout on this one. Batted out there this evening nicely as well with Luke Holman. Uh, what's the thoughts going into day three on how the pitch might play? Yeah, obviously I think you've seen there's obviously a little bit of up and down in the wicket. Um, generally, there's a little bit of seam movement. Um, just one of, going to be one of those things where you know I think uh, once guys are in, um, you know it's about how we can uh, find ways of, of, of dotting them up and, and, and getting wickets. Um, you know, it's a pretty simple plan for us. I think you know it's uh, you know just trying to do what we do. Um, you know you've seen our attack with, with Mert, Ethan, and, and you know, back to Toby and um, and uh, Martin, and, and, and you know, obviously there's a little bit of spin out there. So Luke should come in to get a little bit later, but um, you know, I think the wickets reasonable. Um, you know it has seemed around a little bit. And, you know, still a little bit in there, so you know, I think it's encouraging going into tomorrow. Just a quick final thought on the man at the moment with the bat, Mark Stoneman, a couple of centuries now um, for Middlesex. He's been a real lift, hasn't he, at the top of the order? Yeah, absolutely. I think uh, he couldn't have had a, you know, couldn't have had a West start followed by a, the, the M1 uh, <laughs> down at Hove. So he's had a hell of a start, and, and as we said, um, you know, he played an absolutely fantastic knock here today, where um, you know he's made it look far easier than uh, a lot of us have. So uh, fair credit to him. He's fitted in the, the changing room seamlessly, and uh, you know he's, he's not just added, um, you know, his experience and his, his, his batting. Um, you know, it's, you know I've, I played a, a little bit of cricket through the under 19s England stuff with him, and you know he's always been a, a good man, hard worker, and somebody that you want around your changing room. So as I said, he's fitted in seamlessly, and you know today we'll go and have a beer and, and celebrate what was a great night. Thanks for your time tonight. Cheers.